G'day, and welcome back to episode number eight of this, the Munzee Beginner Tutorial. I was gonna end on seven, but no, eight come up because we're gonna talk about flats today. Flats. By the way, my name is Craig, also known as my Shell in the Munzee world. Welcome. If you haven't yet subscribed to this channel, why not? These Munzee videos come out along with other videos as well. But enough of the chit chat, enough of the chinwag, let's talk about flats. So what are flats, like flat friends and flat objects, for instance, as well? Well, what Munzee have done is they've got the normal map, right? The normal map. And then they've put a second map on top, like a flat map, a flat map on top. So you can actually overlap flats and normal virtual Munzees as well. How cool is that? You can overlap these now with use of flats. In total, there is four flat friends, and they being the representation actually of the people who work within Munzee itself. Number one, and one of my favorites is right here, Flat Rob. He is the president of Munzee, the numero uno, the big bahuna, the big bang. <laughs> flat Rob is gonna hate me for saying that. Next one right here is Flat Lou his wife, and also in charge of the events. We have this guy here, Flat Matt, and also Flat Hammock as well. So they're the four different types of flat friends. Before I move on to flat objects, I'll say this, the flat friends, mm, sometimes they can be bouncers too. Remember that in a previous episode? Yep, the flat friends can be a special bouncer as well. Look on out for those. One thing I actually really enjoy about these flats themselves, before we move on to the object, flat objects, is that they give you a split, a split, points system. What's a split point system, Craig? Well, a split point system is this. To give you an idea, if I was to cap right here, Flat Rob, if I was to cap him myself, he has a total of 76 points available on him. 76 points. When I cap him, I get a split of that 76 and the owner of the virtual gets us the other split. But they, the, the split itself adds up to 76 points. So for an example, I may get 16 points for this cap. I go, oh, 16 points. Guess what? The owner of it gets 60 points, that's right. So it varies, it always varies. It's a split point system. I really like this, this is pretty cool. Now let's move on to flat objects. There's a total of nine flat objects and these flat objects still, guess what? Represent those who work within Munzee itself, which is pretty cool. First one we have is this one here, flat DHS. DHS, like VHS? Yeah, but he is Dylan. He does a great job within Munzee itself and loves his movies. Then we have the flat disc golf basket. That's right, the flat disc golf basket. Again, this represents Robbie, who loves his outdoor activities and really enjoys his disc golf. Next up, we have the flat flashlight. This represents Tamara because she loves the mystery of things and you know, the flashlight looking around. She also loves scary movies as well. So the flashlight, ooh. <laughs> Next up, we have the flat typewriter. This kind of signifies Craig's age range, uh, I do believe. Don't hate me for that, Craig, don't hate me. Uh, Craig there, he's the CEO of Munzee, and yeah, that's he is that's his flat right there. Next up, we have flat Murray. Yes, it's a corgi, why? Because Wiley owns the corgi, and that's the love of her life, apparently. So that's the reason why we have the, the flat corgi, or the flat Murray. I think Murray, Murray would have been the corgi's name, I'm sure. Next up, we have flat cats, flat cats. Again, same sort of thing as the flat Murray, but this is Mari's version. Mari is a cat lover and again, works with Munzee. And so we have the flat cats. I love this one. It is brand new. It's the flat cup like that right there, the flat cup. This is for the, the newest person on the team. His name is Sam and he is the person behind. Remember the app I said in episode number one, Cup of Z? Yes, he is the person behind that app, Cup of Z. Hence the reason why he has a flat cup, two more to go. Next one, we have the flat van. The flat van represents Dale and Barb who own Space Coast Geo Store down in Florida and who work with Munzee a lot of the time as well in terms of different events. They travel to different events. And guess what? Yes, this is their actual van. This is what it looks like. It's really, really cool. Tip. If you see this van out in the wild, make sure you actually fag them down whenever they're on their travels. They'll give you number one, they'll give you a special scan code and they may give you a little gift as well, flagging them down. So if you see this van in the wild, USA only, <laughs> then make sure you flag them down. And last but definitely not least, we have this one here, the flat rum. This one here represents all the reseller Munzees out there in the world as well. And we thank you for all your help and support. I'll give you that tip right there. But this here, flat rums. 
you will find that in some cases you may have a clan war task or a daily zeop task where you have to uh, like collect one of these rums or deploy one of these rums so yeah the flat rums they are pretty cool and there you have it this ends episode number eight of this munzee basic beginner tutorial i hope you enjoyed if you have give me a thumbs up if you haven't give me the thumbs down either way make sure you subscribe to this channel for all your munzee and geocaching needs as well in the meantime this is see my shell thanks for watching i'm over and out Ho, 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 ho.